Hey guys, Christine here. So I decided that while I'm making videos, I thought I would make more than one to kind of get myself used to posting videos on YouTube. So I'm going to break some serious YouTube rules and post a video about what's in my purse. Most people usually do this video if they're tagged or asked by someone to do it, but I figured it'd be a good starter video for me considering I only have one video up before this one. So let's get started. Oh, and by the way, if you hear anything, I live in a dorm building, so you're going to hear people being really noisy because I live next door to three really loud guys. So, um, My purse is a Victoria's Secret bag. My ex-boyfriend got it for me, um, I think, like, almost two years ago now. So it's just one big bag. There's no extra pockets or anything special about it. All right. So the first thing in my purse are two Bath & Body Works coupons to save 20% because my roommate and I got a wallflower and it smells amazing. It literally smells like Abercrombie & Fitch in our room all the time. It is like the most amazing smell. Um, next is some extra Fruit Sensations gum which is delicious and for some reason I've had the sudden craving to chew gum like all the time so I put that in there uh, I think yesterday then I have my wallet which is relatively boring just has stars on it and it's black and it has all kinds of like cards and stuff on it and nothing too exciting and the next one is kind of bad but I have an unopened pack of cigarettes yes I do smoke I know it's bad for you you don't need to lecture me in the comments um I also have this really cool lighter which I don't know if you'll be able to see it inside but it turns green eventually there you go you can kind of see it but the light turns from blue to green when it heats up it's kind of cool um sunglasses these are my everyday kind of casual sunglasses nothing very exciting um let's see i have a camera which is boring it's just a sony cyber shot kind of cheap camera it's really nothing special i'm trying to decide if i should record videos more on my mac or if i should start using this the problem with using this is i can't see myself like in the camera because the the viewfinder is behind it so I'm not going to be able to see myself and know if I'm in the frame or if I'm looking in the right area or anything like that whereas my laptop I can see myself so I'm trying to sort that out and trying to figure out what device I'd like to get in order to record better quality videos for you guys next is a AA battery <laughs> um we tend to have a lot of these because we use our Xbox all the time and you need AA batteries to put in the controllers. So I had to get some of those. I also have these pair of sunglasses that are actually my dad's, but I stole them because they're used for driving because they don't impair your vision at all. How like some, some <laughs> sunglasses can kind of like how they're curved and everything can mess with your vision. And so the X on my hand is um, my school is doing this whole entire thing to do with slavery and how slavery still exists in the country. Be aware. You should look it up, actually. Slavery is still something that goes on all the time across the world. Thousands upon thousands of kids and women and even men are put into slavery, and it's this horrible thing. So that's to raise awareness for that, just so you know. <laughs> um... I also have another lighter in here. It's a Cheech and Chong lighter. I've never even really seen Cheech and Chong, and I don't know how I got this lighter. But, yeah. <laughs> um, okay, the next thing is <laughs> kind of funny. It's a pocket knife that one of my really good guy friends got me because, well, I'm a female, clearly, and I live in a, I guess you would call it a city, and it's a very high drug area, I guess you would call it. Um, so there isn't a lot of very nice people here. And considering I pretty much am on my own a lot, he thought this would be a good idea to have in my purse in case something ever happens so I could defend myself and just be like, Wacha! Yeah, I haven't had to use it yet, so that's a good thing. 
Um, okay, there's like 500 hair ties in this. Like, <laughs> I don't even know. Um, a pen. That's not exciting. Another hair tie. I have some chapstick that I got from Hot Topic. Cool peppermint. Really good. Um, there's the other AA battery. <laughs> And I have some more chapstick, which this stuff, I recommend it to anyone who has really chapped lips because in the wintertime, mine get really bad. You can kind of see it in the light. Um, it's uh, Blistics Complete Moisture SPF 15, and it is amazing. Like, I can't even begin to tell you. It is so moisturizing, and it's not, like, sticky. It, like, it's, oh, it's perfect. I love it. Um, another pen. And I have a button that I got today. It's a little puzzle piece. And we got it because I signed up to be a bone marrow donator. Um, because at our school today, they were asking people to sign up. And I figured it would be a good thing to do. I, you know, it wouldn't hurt. It'd save someone's life. I mean, why, why not do it? Um, Okay, only one more thing after this, and this is an Outlast lip stain in the number 427. It's like a burgundy red color. I don't particularly like lipsticks, so I tend to use lip stains more than anything. Um, if you guys know of any like really nice lipsticks that aren't really thick and goopy kind of on your lips, just let me know, um, because I haven't really found anything that I really like. So I tend to use these lip stains, and... I really like them. They last a really long time, the Outlast ones do, at least for me anyway. Um, so yeah, there's that. And then the last thing is these two earrings, which I think I got from Claire's actually, if I can. It's not that exciting. Um, so yeah, that's what's in my purse. There's usually a lot more in there, and it's usually like so cluttered it's not even funny. But I cleaned it out a couple days ago, so it's relatively organized. But, uh, alright, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, you can hit like or subscribe or comment down below. Have a good day. Bye.